All right, y'all, Willie Reps back with a 10 kilogram haul. And this haul came way off sugar goo. We have one, two, three, four, five pairs of sneakers, a bunch of shirts, two pairs of pants, and some fabric. And let's get into this review. So the first item up is two pairs of CPFM dunk, uh, socks. As you can see, quality looks pretty good. Um, they are a little thin on thin, but I got these off of 1688. Enough about that. Let's get into some shirts. First item up is the Biggie Kit shirt which you know I like hip hop there's your tag I go size large this didn't come with any other um, tags or size and as you can see plain shirt nice quality on the blank um, the the print could have been a little bit lighter in my opinion but it is a nice print Get into another 1688 item, and here we have the Curl Essentials tee. Only thing I can see that's absolutely wrong is this collar line it is super, super big. Um, I do have another one around here, but other than that, blank of the shirt is really nice. Um, the embroidery or the emboss of the essentials on the shirt is really nice. Here is your tag on the back. Here's your essentials tag. Fear of God. Again, 1688. And the only thing that really stands out to me is that um, that collar line, that neckline on that collar. Next item up is Sell Your Soul Supreme T-shirt, large. Now, quality on this blank is really nice. Print looks really good overall. Nothing's on the back. Definitely one of my favorites in, in the, the haul. Next is going to be on another Kiff hip hop shirt. As you can see, Tupac Poetic Justice, Kiff Justice. Um, quality of the blank is really nice. Here's your tag. Nothing else is in it. No extra tags or anything. But overall, definitely nice pickup. And we got a couple more shirts. And this is going to be the Gucci Mane Goo Wop Supreme T. Gucci on the bottom. This is a very nice blank. Here is your tag, neckline, neck collar looks pretty good. Here's the back end of it, Supreme, Trap God 1017, Goo Wop. I will post all of these links if they're still available in the Discord group. Next item up is going to be a Dior fabric. Um, for like four bucks very 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 big you get a lot of fabric um, looks pretty good embroidery on it this is the back side of it overall I plan on doing some uh, random custom work for my sneakers that I have here a couple of them next item up is going to be on the Warren Lotus 
Spider-Man t-shirt. Yes. Now this is definitely a really good quality shirt. It does fit oversized, which majority of his stuff does. Nothing on the back. Overall, definitely, definitely one of my favorites in this um, pickup haul. But let's get into some more items before we get to the sneakers. These are a random 1688 no name pants. Uh, Army fatigue with some custom patchwork going all the way down the left pant leg. Um, definitely suggest going size up. It's just the regular fashion jeans wear. On the back, you do have another another patch and this um, faded Louis Vuitton. Just something different. Get what you like. Don't care if it's hype or not or if people don't like it. Next item up are the Levi's. They're not just your regular Levi's. These are the Levi's Deucey or Stussy. These have buttons all the way down. Uh, on the left pant leg, you do have the D balls, Levi Strauss and Company, Cal, Stussy or Stussy. It is very, very nice quality. Here is your back, your size tag. These fit straight, um, good. Here is the right side, right below the pocket. You will see these on the Instagram channel and Reddit. And now let's get into my favorite parts of the 10 kilogram haul. First up are B grade Yeezy foam runners. Can't go wrong with them. They are definitely super comfortable. You got all your markings on there. Definitely recommend for $8. Let's go into some more. Next item up is going to be the Johnny Kicks. Game in the box. What the dunks. What if they did make a 2022, which you can see different panels from different various sneakers. Um, overall, definitely love my fantasy sneakers, but these are really nice. That was the right sneaker. This is the left sneaker. As you can see, all around, really, really love the concept of all the different sneakers on here. And let's get into another pair, which were some of my favorite out of this. Another, well, they're all my favorite sneakers, that's why I got them. But a pair of 700s in the collection, Hospital Blue, came with the box. Materials are really nice. 3M's everywhere it's supposed to be. Again, definitely, definitely real nice quality here. And here's your box, 700's. Next item up is going to be another fantasy piece. Y'all know me, but let's get into the chem block. Air Jordan 1 Travis Scott's and um, these as you can tell the quality on them material is superior nice material all the way around you do have the monster green which Ken Block um, sponsored um, with some gray 
and again you can just see the quality of this material is really nice here's your toe box material on the toe box is nice heel counter is nice here is your heel tab embroidery along with the monster energy heel counter is very very nice comes with black green and gray um, laces you do have the Ken blocks number 43 Hoonigan um, don't know who designed these but there you go your Ken block going on the back this is a leather um, really nice you do have again the monster colorway there again can't really say too much about these but he was an amazing driver I watched numerous videos of his um, definitely definitely had to get these and um, you know sad when somebody so talented go at an early age really nice here's your cactus jack embroidery monster can block very nice and last but not least my absolutely favorite in this um all goes by way of sk with an amazing air jordan one um we really can't see it uh it is the Derek Jeter Air, Air Jordan 1. And we'll get into this sneaker. They did come with the box. Box um, label. That's pretty much it. Uh, there you go. Probably don't think these were out there like that. But here you go. Your Air Jordan 1. Derek Jeter respect and the the black part right here is all 3M going out around the sneaker uh, here is your Air Jordan logo side profile toe box is looking really really nice and as you can see the wording going through all of their respect fearless focus um, just all around here's your toe box nice the U leather or leather whatever one it is here's your Nike air tag on the tongue hairs on the back side um, the black laces do have this gradient um, white and black shoelace tips as you can see which I think is pretty cool on the white pair it doesn't have that um, on your insole you do have the respect there you go there it is your insole stitching looking pretty good here is your inside tag here is your back end of the sneaker your embroidery um, heel counter is definitely good definitely good soles um, really nice there's your other side of the sneaker definitely really really nice SK um, if he did make them you do have the black so um, if he did create these at his own or source them they did really good job on these really really good there's your wings logo your swoosh your toe box again 3m is all the way around where you see the black going all the way around and when the light hits it at a certain way they look really really good um, nothing else to say, but thank you for watching. Um, follow me. Links all down below. Post it. 
Until next time, Willie Reps. I'm out. <laughs>